Hey, how's it going everyone? This is DCSG81 and today I'm very excited to be doing a review for this GoGo -Go Toys The Battle Damage Thanos Set. Okay, so this Thanos Battle Damage set is the very first release from GoGo -Go Toys. So I'm pretty excited to see how the end product turns out to be. And as always, you know that I will keep it close <laughs> until that I will open it uh, in front of camera with you guys. So I have not opened it up yet. So I don't know how it turns out to be. So let's begin. Okay, wow, quite excited and nervous about it. Okay. Yep, so as we can see, oops, okay, something <laughs> dropped out. So we have a sticker here and it says GoGo -Go Toy. And I believe you guys uh, should see this as a very familiar sign because uh, with the box and the sticker and the cards, it sort of reminds me of uh, Takara Tony, you know, <laughs> they have the same practice. Okay, so this is, uh, yeah, this is like a sticker. I believe like uh, Takara Tony is for you to stick on the box so that uh, when you keep it, you know that this inside is uh, the Tenor sets. Okay, so let's take a look and it looks pretty good. Okay, you can see GG01 which stands for GoGo -Go Toys, I believe. And this is their very first product. Okay, and uh, nothing behind. And we have also a card which looks pretty good with the Tenor standing there. Yep and okay so this is another shot of it yep looks very good okay and let's see okay wow this is very very good looking so let's take out one by one and see what we have here okay the very first of course is the nano gauntlet wow i just love the battle damage you can see that wow it's really good looking there okay very very nice it's really better damage up to the maximum yep <laughs> very nice then we also have uh another hands which is like the open palm hand this is having the uh finger snapping pose this is the relax hand and unfortunately there is no articulations on these hands yep but it still looks very good nevertheless okay and then we have an alternate uh, right arms, okay? This is for those of you who actually bought the SHV Guards uh, Endgame Thanos and uh, you know that, that he's not supposed to have the gauntlet on his right hand so this is for you to interchange it, okay? Something like the Takara Tony said last time whereby I have also made a video here on how you can interchange the arm, okay? So we have, of course, some interchangeable hands for the right arms. Okay, we have a, uh, it comes with a close fist hands. And also a grabbing hands and also another uh, hands for holding the blades of Thanos. Okay, yep. And let's see, he just comes with two heads. Yep, two complete heads, not, not faces, two complete heads. And... Uh, yep it's a better damage ones which looks pretty good by the way yes okay wow just look at it this is having a slight smiling one with all the better damage there and also this one is i think this is the look of it when he's uh right before he get you know feathers away dusted away <laughs> yeah the last scenes very very good looking my goodness there wow well at the same time it just comes with some extra joints okay which looks like this hmm okay i wonder why is it for is it for the heads maybe yep i think it's for the heads it's quite loose but it does fit you can hear the clicking sound just now i'll try on the other head oh, this one doesn't have it yep <laughs> but it's still sticks around okay then we also have uh oh there's another small joints here white color uh i believe this is for 
the nano gauntlet if I'm not wrong. No, oh, I think I'm wrong. Sorry about that. <laughs> not sure what is this for. A small packs, white packs. And of course, it just comes with the blade of Thanos. Okay. Okay. So this is the perfect looking ones. Yep. And you can join them together. I believe so. Let's see. See like this. Yep. It's a very big one. Wow. Just look at it. The details are pretty amazing though. And of course, let's see. He just comes with another battle damage one. This is the one that I'm interested on. You can see that. Wow, it's very very nice. This is the broken one. Very awesome. And let's see how it looks like. Yes, like this. A broken piece. This is awesome looking. Okay. Yep. Very very nice. You can even compare it side by side and see that it has broken up very nicely. Okay. Okay, next I'm going to try all the accessories on my SHV Guard Thanos. I have the uh, <laughs> Infinity War Thanos right over here. Okay, of course I know it's not meant for this Thanos. And I also do have the uh, Endgame Thanos, okay, which is meant for this one. And I know a lot of you actually want to see this set on the final battle Thanos, which unfortunately I didn't get that one because as you know it's a lot a lot more pricier but in return I do have this uh, battle damage Thanos this is not the original one this is uh, actually a bootleg as you can see it's slightly smaller than the original and this battle damage one is uh, actually done by Takara Tony uh, he did a battle damage wash on the armor which looks pretty good now Yep, so he gave me this one as a gift, which I'm very, very appreciate of that. So we, I will try it on this one as well to see how good it looks. Let's get started with the heads first. Okay, so we have two heads like I mentioned just now that it comes with. Okay, and I'm going to compare it with the original head from SH3 Guards. Um, this is one of it. Okay, so we all know that the expression is different. Okay, yep, you can see it's almost very identical, even the uh, skill is looking very much the same, but the pain, the better damage, this looks very well done, okay, yep, so I'm just going to try on this one first, okay, let's see. doesn't seem to go in my bad it does go in but you just uh, need to push in a lot harder and I think somehow the packs is quite long that makes him looks like he's having a very long neck okay yeah maybe this is what uh, this pack is for to use on this neck okay I'm not sure about that okay I'll just <laughs> leave it on for now yeah, with the weird looking long neck Thanos and then I'll try it onto this one. Let's see how it goes. Okay. Yep, it just go in and again I think the neck is slightly longer than usual, okay? This is weird. It looks very weird. Okay, maybe I should, should try on to this one instead. Okay, so I managed to remove the joint packs and it's not easy to remove it. I have to use the tweezer and trust me, this is very, very tight inside and be very careful when you are trying to remove it, okay? So I'm not even sure if I'm supposed to do that because <laughs> I just want to try on this one because it just doesn't look right with the long neck. <laughs> okay, so let's try. Hopefully, I'm correct. Whew. Again, it's very very hard to push it in, but at least I managed to do so. You can see that 
the pack is I think it's a uh, shorter I hope hmm doesn't seem to be <laughs> okay let's try it on now yes yep I think this one does fits better compared to using the original neck as you can I'm um, sorry the original pack as you can see this one is having the longer neck and this one looks better in a way okay, you can see from the side view yep you can see how much the head being jacked up with the longer original packs wow this one just looks okay yeah but again you can see that there's a very obvious skin tone difference with this uh head from google toy although it just looks very good now okay yeah with the better damage but it still looks odd with a very clean shining armor <laughs> yep and you can see that mine already been exchanged with the takara tony interchangeable arms it just looks very uh, similar though okay so originally it does have the uh, infinity gauntlet which i have interchanged to this thanos instead okay so this one does comes from this thanos because the original one that comes with this one is a lot more goldish like this kind of gold it looks uh very odd so i changed it to this one which looks better okay yep so that uh what else should we try on oh the gauntlets okay the nano gauntlets uh yep i should try it on and i'm not sure if i can pull it out <laughs> it's kind of scary though ah uh, no okay i managed to pull out the entire arms but not this part here so i'm just going to try it again and if it doesn't work i'm just going to give up because i remember how hard it is to remove this one to interchange with this arm so i'm not going to go through the whole ordeal again <laughs> that's very torturing uh okay so it's not going to work yep so i'm just going to leave it because i don't want to you know damage my thanos <laughs> i'll be going to try it on but with this one instead i think it will match better in a way okay so let's try with this thanos now well this one is also very hard to remove <laughs> Whew. okay again it's a very painful process of uh, removing the arms even from this bootleg wow this took me a great effort to remove it as you can see i have removed it and let's try with this uh, nano gauntlet's hand and i do hope that it fits after all the <laughs> efforts try on yes it does fit okay and he just looks awesome by the way wow because it does match with the better damage uh, um, armor this time i think it looks better and this one comes out on its own <laughs> yep even without the uh, <laughs> any efforts being tried on i think this one is loose already okay yeah it just looks very odd with two nano gauntlets i think maybe i'll interchange with this one remove the blue tag okay yes wow so it just looks even better now okay with the nano gauntlet hands yes this one looks awesome let's try on the heads okay uh this one let's see if it does fit yes it does fit and again the long packs i think i'm going to change it oh this one is easier maybe because it's a uh, bootleg okay now i'm going to remove this one again i think it will be a torture oh there it goes again <laughs> ah, ah my goodness my hands hurts okay, okay so i've managed to put it into the head let's try now and ah going okay yeah so it went in and voila oh this time the pain i think it looks slightly better compared to the uh, original because i think um takara tony has already sprayed some um, 
some dark paint on it so it doesn't look as bright and it does match with this head slightly better compared to the original ones yeah so this one just looks good okay and let's try to change to the other hands which is the open uh, palm hands wow this looks awesome by the way yep and now let's try with the last thing which is the blade of Thanos okay so this is something that I just noticed that if you take a look at the relaxed hand on the left you can see all the infinity stone is still intact while the one with the snapping finger pose is blank Yeah, it's being taken away by Tony Stark without his knowledge. It is so detailed that Google Toys even put this into their work. Okay, so for the Blade of Thanos, before I get started, I just want to show it to you guys on how big different it is as compared to the one from Takara Tony. So this is the one from Takara Tony. Yep, looking very nice there. And this is the one from Google Toys. Wow, my goodness, just take a look at the size differences. Wow, <laughs> I think they actually made it a lot too big for the Google Toys. It's too much, as you can see. My goodness, it's like a 112 scale versus a 19 scale. It's too huge. I think they need to smaller it a little bit. I think this one looks just fine from Takara Tony. This one is <laughs> slightly bigger wow okay so let's let him hold on to it and then we can see how huge it is so now we can see goodness goodness it's too big isn't it you can see that wow it's like my goodness <laughs> this is it's just too huge for him and let's compare with this one holding on to the Takara Tony's ones. Okay, yep, so this is from Takara Tony and this is from the Gogo -Go toy. <laughs> so which one do you think it looks uh more screen accurate? Yep, I think I do think that this one just look fine. Maybe just a tiny bit bigger will be better, but this is a lot bigger. <laughs> <laughs> yep, it just looks like uh, Cloud Strife holding his his sword. Yep, and of course I will even show you the um, original SH Reguards holding on to it because this Thanos is uh, slightly bigger than this bootleg, so we can have a look on is it really bigger than it should be. Yep, so this is how it looks like. Um, I still feel that it's too huge yep just too big for him okay so i have changed the head to the other alternate head this one is slightly smiling wickedly okay with a better damage uh, armor from takara tony and also the snapping finger pose and with the broken blade of Thanos. okay yep so overall i think it just looks okay for this one uh, of course again this is not the original SHV Guards and also there's a custom paint from the master Takara Tony so I think it actually complements this Google toy set a lot it's like a match made in heaven for both of them yep so if you were to ask me um, does this set from Google toys really matches the original uh, SHV Guards uh, Endgame Thanos, I think not because the head itself you can see there's a very big difference in terms of the paint unless what you want is just the nano gauntlets and the blade of Thanos even with the better damage ones then I think yes it might work but you will have to get off this arm first <laughs> at your own risk okay yep so but as for the um, Final Battle Thanos, I can't answer you because I don't have that Thanos but yes, I will still think that it might work for the head I think it will actually match better with that Thanos 
and also the uh, nano gauntlets and also the blades yeah okay so sorry that i don't have the tenos to try this set on i would love to but unfortunately i just can't spend that kind of money on another tenos okay so my final verdict for this tenos is i'm going to give it a i think 8 out of 10 because uh, i kind of like the uh, the whole set uh, with the heads the better damage nano gauntlet is my favorite and also i do think that this uh, better damage uh, sword is looking very good even though it's a little bit too big for my liking <laughs> yeah i think it's a bit oversized and yeah so other than that i think it's a good set just that you really have to you know put some efforts to remove the hands to use these nano gallon hands and also um yeah that's about it and hopefully if you have the better damage uh tenos the final battle tenos from SHV Guards, this head will fit better even though now I think it just looks quite good for this uh, custom work from uh, Takara yep. so uh, if you are still interested to get this GoGo toys you can actually contact Takara Tony in Facebook yep. I have checked with him, he does have a few more sets available so you can contact him via um, Facebook yep. he is very responsive and you can purchase this set from him okay so that's all for this review i hope you do like it and find it informative do give me a thumbs up if you do and of course always feel free to leave me any comments or any questions that you have with regards to this gogo -Go toy set down in the comment section below and if you're still around do check out my playlist right over here and also do browse around my channel because i have a lot of interesting videos such as this one and i'm pretty sure that you will find something that interests you and i'll see you in my next video as always take care and thank you for watching bye